We'll take a look at this video from Hartford. This is along Ward Place. Eyewitness News viewer Giovanni says the road was completely flooded and water was rushing towards McDonough Middle School. So continuing our team coverage now of the weather, Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Mike Savino. Mike, you are in Hartford on Pope Park Highway. Yes, and this is one of the few spots, Courtney, where we still have flooding. I'll step out of the way so you can see. And uh, it's been receding a little bit, uh, so it's a lot lower now. Actually, the majority of the cars that have been coming through here have been able to get through at this point, as you can see this uh, car coming through right now. Uh, but this is one of the few spots where we're still seeing flooding here in Hartford. As Bruce talked about, it was really coming down hard uh, for a little while here. We were over at the Arroyo uh, Recreation Center, which is in another part of the city, and it was pouring over there. Of course, they didn't have the flooding issues that we're seeing in the south end of the city. We were over at Ward Place uh, about an hour ago and talked to some of the people who saw what you saw in that video, Courtney. Water rushing down Ward, also rushing down Broad Street near that intersection section. People saying that that's the worst flooding they've seen uh, in some time. Uh, and over there as well, cars trying to get through, some were getting stuck, uh, and people just really trying to uh, get uh, out of the water. It took easily an hour, hour and a half for things to clear up over there. Take a listen. It happens a, a lot, a lot, a lot of time. I was actually, actually talking about, with one of my friends, I was actually talking about, I think that what they should have did was they should have probably, when they repair the streets, they should make it at an angle because you know that it's going to flood. So all of a sudden the water got so big that, it, it, I mean, you start seeing mattresses going down. You start seeing pillows. You start seeing everything going down. Then. And Hartford police were actually reporting uh, flooding in easily a half dozen spots around the city here in the south end, including a couple spots on Hamilton Street. Obviously, you can see right here behind me as we're near the intersection with Hamilton Street, there, there is still a little bit of flooding. And of course, some damage uh, over on Airport Road near Weathersfield Avenue. So even though the flooding is largely cleared up around the city, you should still be careful as you're driving around because there are still some lingering problems. Reporting live from Hartford, Mike Savino, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.